Okay guys, so uh, we are going to continue where we left off last time with the Alan Wake. So yeah, let's get right on to it. All right. Let's just start the game. I really can't wait to play again since last time we uh, left off with uh, Alan Wake. So we are starting to control the main character, which is Alan Wake. But yeah, we'll see how it's gonna turn out. We've been here before, so I think after this we're just gonna try to skip the uh lose out of control. Yeah, I think we just gotta skip this march out in the fucking tower. Cinematic. Had I already done the show? Was that a car? All right, let's skip right past this. Yeah, this is where we left off last time. So, yeah, we're just gonna continue from this point on. Hello. Something's not right here. Yeah. I needed to get home to Alice. Just gonna keep following the lights. I don't think we're gonna find anything here. There. Yeah, let's just go to the exit. What the hell was that interview? Some kind of joke? Initiation? I never wrote a book called Initiation. This felt like a bad dream. Could make a good horror story. It is a horror story. <laughs> I think you're in then. You're in it. Okay. Let's go. Keep following the exit. Old Gods of Asgard. That name sounded familiar. Neighbor of the Beast 666. Should be 666, don't you think? <laughs> Why they keep, like, why are they missing one more, one number? Yeah, I found a workaround where I can channel the audio into my headset now. So, I was a mess. I had never heard of this talk show or Mr. Door before. None of it felt right. Was I losing my mind? Is it 665? The one that we just saw earlier? Let's try that. There you go. <laughs> so easy. There was something here. A broken transmission I couldn't quite make out. That's not, that's what not was that? A message? Right. Impossible to say. I just love the atmosphere in this game, guys, like I mentioned to you multiple times. There was 
was something in the studio with me. I had to get out. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. It's pretty scary. surfaced about riding here for countless days. Interesting now with uh, Alan. Yeah, now with Alan, we got instead of a case board, we got the draft board, the plot board for his book. Right? I'm really loving these soundtracks, guys. Like, it's really nice, very moody. Get right on to it. I didn't remember much, but I knew my thoughts and ideas could manifest as reality in this dark place. I used my writing to project myself out of this room. It's almost like a looping story, right? You need to figure out a way to get out of this looping story. His life is repeating until he figure out what to do. question to the man sitting right next to you, but how do you feel about him in the role of Casey? Does he look the part to you? <laughs> He's grimace again, over and over again. He looks again. exactly like I always imagined Casey to be. It's uncanny. Thank you. That means so much to me. I'm a huge fan of your books. So, uh, what's the problem, Alan? Because 
On more than one occasion, you've voiced your reservations about the adaptations. Uh, it's not that. They're their own thing. They've gone with choices that are different from mine. I... I... I feel protective about my stories, and these adaptations... I, I don't know, I, I guess I just wish I could have been more involved in making them. Well, in that case, you won't have seen this either. We have a clip from the new film, Murder Case Case. Should we roll it, or do you want to say something first, Sam? Nah, just roll it. This city was an old scar that refused to heal. The rain made it fester. It needed the sun, but there was only the night. I was tired. Insomnia covered me like a plastic film. I was watching the world through a rain-slick window. My own reflection haunting the view. I was trying to track down a missing writer. My only clue was a table lamp shaped like an angel. The only thing to shed light on this sordid mystery. Man, I really like this game. It's so artistic. Really well done. You couldn't figure out what's happening, or like you couldn't even figure out the plot. So there's a lot of mystery. A lot of mystery surrounding this story. Same thing over and over. Right. It wasn't close earlier. Five, six. in the second one. Alright, 665. Alright, there you go. 565. Five. There you go. Pretty easy. Alright, now let's see if we can turn the TV on. Huh? Still not turning on. Alright, doesn't matter. If there's anything you can get here, nothing. The story progressing. Somebody in here. Somebody's humming. Definitely need a map. Ah, Lorraine! There you are, Tom! Oh, not so much evil that not a bit of good as well. Not one without the other. <laughs> good to see you. Hey, I, I can't seem to find my way out of here. Can you point me to the exit? <laughs> of course, Tom. 
to work will instruct its maker. I was gonna get something from the basement for you, but you can get it yourself now. Uh, the more cooks, the worse the soup. <laughs> Have we met before? Are you trapped in the dark place too? You remember Ahti, the janitor. You can't be lost if you don't worry about where you are headed. So, don't worry, Tom. The sun will shine even into a heap of tricks. Just remember to turn on the lights. It won't take long when you get to work. What do you want me to get from the basement? And my name's Alan, not Tom. Yeah, yeah, but I got up and go, a man, a man, but a man with a two makes two, Tom. Agree. <laughs> and a man with a two can build his own exit. It's in a shoebox, in the basement where you left it. <laughs> Safe as in the Lord's purse. Here's the key. I like it. Get it. Got the janitor's key. I've been trying to find a way to escape the dark place. Any suggestions? He who mouths about his troubles is the prisoner of his troubles. It's not easy to get out. But don't you worry, Tom. The home is still there where the heart is. I often think about it when I mop the floor and look into the puddle. Water is the memory of the world. Water finds its way. The janitor was a bit out there, but still a friendly face. I had to trust the basement would get me out of here. Can't believe he's still narrating his own story <laughs> in his reality. Oh, look at that. Is that a nice poster, eh? Okay. okay let's go here. Let's go back to the basement. Just gonna use the basement door. Basement lock. Here? Oh, that's the basement. Box. We just need to find a shoe box. It's gotta be here somewhere. An old lamp and a shoe box. Was this what the janitor had left for me? This is our safe haven, right? The lamp felt significant. A tool for bringing light to the darkness. I felt a magnetic pull between the lamp and the light overhead. Whoa! When the light jumped into my lamp, the whole room changed. Like something in a dream. Opening a way forward, the lamp was humming. The bulb glowed. It held the light now. Alright, seems like you're gonna have to take this light somewhere. So you can open up. A new path for Alan, I, I assume. Yeah. Is it here? No. I don't think so. Well, we can I found a there. surge from the lamp. Oh, there you go. I had used the glow in the lamp went out. Oh, nice. Shifting the light in the room. All right. The light carved out something new from the darkness. Oh, there you go. I think I'm starting to figure out how this thing works. Alright, let's go there. It's pretty fun. So, people are saying that, you know, Alan's story, uh, like his reality in New York, is actually better than 
uh, the FBI agent because yeah because of the uh, the texture and the way they depict this place right it seems like we can use the lights here the dark place wants to draw me there you go. I'm losing myself I have to fight it I have to remember the clicker the light switch I lost it but I have the lamp now the lamp the switch was cut from this place is a nightmare not real and yet more real than anything the danger and the horror are real it feeds off my mind twisting whatever it takes into psychotic reality I'm trapped here I write to escape I've tried this many times written countless stories forgotten how many I keep failing but I must keep trying. I use the story to dive deeper. Every word I write is a step forward on the spiral of the darkness. I dive to the body to find the answer to the map, the key, the compass, the combined to fall the door leading out. But how do you open a door that's not a door? I want an ocean, it's not an ocean, and a lake. That's not a lake. Alright. Getting somewhere. Let's continue. Let's get right on to it. Let's get that. Let's get the light again. Find a way to get out of the studio. Right. You know, I really enjoy playing horror games for some reasons. I know it might be like there are a lot of jump scares and things like that, but... I needed to find another way out. I feel like I'm getting stronger each time I play something scary, you know. We just came from there, so we gotta find another exit. There you go. No? Man, I'm so bad with directions. I thought we were getting somewhere. But no, we're just stuck here. Ah! Man, all that and turns out the way is just right over here. <laughs> just right in front of us. Oh, look at that. Hey, phone's ringing. Somehow, this is what they say me. by the New York environment, as you can see. This is a really gorgeous rendered environment. Do I know you? 
I, I know you from somewhere. You just forgotten again. We're in it together. Don't worry. I got it now. We've been working. Great. I I'm losing you. Hello? Hello? <laughs> This is totally how a writer would write the main character story, you know, uh, if you follow the story structure you would know how the main character is supposed to find something that can help to move on the story. Yeah, that's Captain Matt. There you go. Now we gotta find Caldera Street Station, it's just right over there. The man had said Caldera Street Station. I had to go there. We've seen this before. I had to find the subway station. Our police wants to draw me. I'm losing yeah, myself. Actually, actually, two goals here. Looks amazing. There are a few entities that follows you around that I think you should avoid. Something like that. Look at that. There are a few. The Caldera Street Station sign was there. But the entrance was missing. I had to make it appear. Maybe I could use the lamp to reveal the station entrance. The lamp was dead in my hand. I needed to find a light for it. So apparently the, the, the dark entities are trying to become him. I like how they still use the old PCR thing. You know? It's, uh, it's an ancient thing nowadays. You can't really find anything like that nowadays. Shadows like, resembles human form. I believe they are the, uh, the dark entity, so we're just gonna pass through them. It's a little bit more cautious this time around. Is 
this the way it was on the page? What the hell? Oh, hey. We met at Door Show. Alan Wake, the writer. I'm Alex Casey, looking into a murder. Come on, what? What is this? There's a piece of evidence, a manuscript of a novel. You wouldn't know anything about it? A manuscript? What manuscript? I need to see it. Rumor had it the manuscript contained the details of the murders. The murder cult was following the story to commit their gruesome acts. Was Wake their leader? Had he written it? How far would he go to create a perfect work of art? Or would he be the next victim? Gun and get the flashlight. We got both. This cool. was an echo of the books I had written for years. Picking up Casey's gun felt like I was assuming the role yeah, of the detective. Yeah, that's pretty gruesome. What happened to you, Casey? It's a mystery that we're trying to connect. Let's get this light. Got it. I had a light now. I needed to get Let's back see if to the subway find some ammo here. I don't think there is any, but oh, look at that! There's a yellow sign. Cult of the world. Oh, just looping. Same thing over and over again. I think I better go back first to yeah, the other one, the other alley. Shit, with the alley in darkness now, we gotta get rid of the shadows. Pretty sure they're gonna disappear once we show the light. Right. Looks like it's clear. I like how powerful the flashlight in this game, you know, it's like that, like, this is so powerful. They're gonna disappear by itself, hopefully.
Guys, don't forget to reload. There we go. Right now we are back. Yep. I could use the light to open the Still subway there. entrance now. Slow. I needed to find another light to go deeper inside. Slow, no, not rushing or anything like that. Get as much ammo as possible. Right. I need to get another light. Looks like we gotta have to take it from here. Let's see if this will work. Nope. So that's not how it works. How about this one right here? I really love the environment in this game. Like it's very next gen and also it's just such a joy to watch, you know. I don't know, I'm a sucker for this kind of thing. I really love these sort of things. Ooh. Anything since like find Alice? of the word see if we can find something here these rooftops they just disappear <laughs> Love how powerful this flashlight is. Awesome! Another ammo. Thing. I don't know. It's just back now. 
feel like he might be in. Just can't hurt me. You can't hurt me. I'm invisible. Okay. Let's see if we can find another item. Oh, okay. Let's go here. Okay. Let's go here. So we got a lot of ammo, which is good. I'm gonna try to get back to where we should go again. Maybe we should go this way. Okay, there was something hidden here. Like would reveal it. Isn't it? The repeated over and over. The words resonated with meaning. Had I written this? Let's try. It's a fake source of stuff. Okay, so apparently this is sort of a skill-based level where you can, um, I think, upgrade yourself. Yeah, it's gonna be difficult. <laughs> what should we do? Mm -hmm. Increase maximum health. Feels like we kind of need health for sure. Battery. We need that too. Full stop. Paint the towel. Around. Prescription pictures. Trace map. It's a bug. Snatch up. So it seems like we can only add here from Words of Lab. Restores 50 health for each second when using plus like boost of hostile shadow. That provides 10% chance to stun enemies on plus like boost. 25% of the game, it flies like Josh with killing an enemy. Uh, feels like we need to stun enemies. 50% health. I, I don't think we're gonna need that for now. Let's just go with this. The headlights. There you go. You as long as you carry this torch, which is pretty awesome, by the way. Yep. Always check the corners, guys, because it's gonna be a lot more stuff that you can find. Like that.
check the other corner. Make sure we don't miss anything. Let's get this. We got the light. Right. Reload. As long as we got ammo and we got the first light, I'm not afraid of anything. So yeah, let's keep on going. Yeah, this is pretty fun as long as you know what you're doing. And once you pick up the pace, you're starting to understand how to play this game. Which is super fine. The gates to the platform were closed. I had a ticket. Alright. But first we're gonna have to get all the items we can get. We got everything here by now. Alright, let's do this. Use the subway pass. Something about the station platform felt significant. It would work in my writing, but I needed more. Something lingered here. A half forgotten memory. An echo. The FBI agent had come here before me on the trail of a murder cult. He'd gone missing. Presumed dead. The cult was leaving me clues to follow, connecting the dots from one murder to the next, inviting me to draw an obscene picture on the city map. Caldera Street Station. The name made me think of the exit wound of the bullet. I had a flash of inspiration. The ghost of my fictional detective. Right. A story thread I could That's use in my right. writing. I had a location. I had a story thread. I would put them together, write them into my story to create a path deeper into the dark place. into place. The story rang true. I was making progress. The dark place reacted to my story. The way into the tunnels was no longer blocked. Yeah, that's the blood trails. So we're gonna have to keep looking. Make sure we don't miss any potential items or anything like that. Let's just try to search for yeah there you go. Okay it's locked. It could not be opened on this side. Nice. Check your corners. Especially when items are scarce in this movie, right? Uh, in this game, so... <laughs> See, I said movie because it really looks like a movie to me. But, yeah. Always remember to check the corners because the items are scarce. And the best way is to always look for more the fed had glimpsed into the maw of darkness and swallowed him whole. What 
The tracks led into the tunnel. That was my way forward. You know what's crazy about this game? It kind of looks, it kind of reminds me of Resident Evil. Even the way John's running is very Leon Kennedy. Right? I don't know if you noticed, but that's how I feel. Yeah, let's, yeah I'm pretty sure it's going to be a, another boss fight in here. That's why there's a safe room. So let's quickly save and let's deal with this boss, alright? I'm not afraid to take the stand, everybody. Okay, there's gonna be something, another one. Another writing. Okay, there you go. Yes. Increase hand flare area by 50%. Increase effectiveness of trauma pads, effect duration of painkillers. Of course, it's this one. Yep. What else do we have? Okay, nothing. Not much. That's it, we got it. Love the soundtrack, it's so eerie. I love when a game doesn't use too much music, more more of like nice. Okay, let's get all of them. Is there a way that we can Is there a way that we can assign you know these things? Flashbangs. I would love to use it, but for now I'm just gonna use this hand flare. Okay, trauma pads, right? And killers. Okay, I'll stick with it for now. Yeah, I don't think there's an any thing more we can find here, so we're gonna have to. Tunnels were a maze. The blood trail led me on. Let's see. Let's check here. We need to find another light source first before we can open up the door to the other side, right? Yeah. 
Another place to use in this story. I needed to search the tunnels for further visions. Inspiration for the story that would lead me deeper. The new scene I had found was important for the story. That changed the story. <laughs> and with that, the dark place it's incredible. changed. Incredible. It's gonna be an echo. it in order to change it. Oh wow, okay. So okay. we need to align ourselves with this echo. My writing was affecting reality. Fed came looking for the cult, but it was a trap, a satanic blood sacrifice. Anyone who gets involved with the cult, they're next. I heard their leader is this famous writer, Alan Wake, their unholy motherfucking messiah. Sounds like a load of bull. There you go. So there's some mystery around him, Alan Wake. had come here looking for answers. All he found was a fate worse than death. What's this? of inspiration. There's nothing here. There's no way I'm going to turn my spotlight off. <laughs> well, well, if the... Where's that? It's here. Let's see. There you go. The water was gone. The way forward was open. Really? Nope. Uh, 
your life here. No problem. Last night on. Night Springs, Lost, the Shrine Street, Upper Initiations. Go check out that hump. Or was it? Was it there or? Yeah, we better Let me check this out. Sorry. Have we met? Memory problems again, huh? Yeah, we've met. Tim Breaker. We've shared notes. Hey, I've made some progress on the map, if you want to take a look. What is I still haven't found my mystery man, though. Okay. <laughs> well, that's my crazy wall. Door. I'm just trying to make sense of things. Don't judge me. I'll trade your walls any day. Who's this mystery man? Oh, it wouldn't be much of a mystery if I knew. All I have is a name. Warlandor. The talk show host? No. No, that doesn't sound like him. The guy has many disguises, but a talk show host? I'll keep looking. You're making a map? Trying to. It's hard to map a dream, though. I keep ending up in unexpected places. I find interesting things like those strange markings that react to the light. Mm. But never the one thing that I'm looking for. Feel free to check the map out. Oh, I've been stockpiling supplies while I poke around. If you find a stash, take anything you need. Nice. I appreciate the help. All right. Let's get anything useful from here. If there's any. Pretty sure I already took all of them. Yeah, there's nothing much in here. Dude, he sleeps here? <laughs> It's quite a spot to be honest. Not bad at all. I mean, despite the fact that he's trapped in this reality. That sucks, but. Okay, let's keep going. Let's keep going. Just another one. Another map. Yeah, there are a few things that we can search there. Store my stuff. 
off just yet. We're getting somewhere. Return. Scratch. Need help. Good luck. Okay. Let's go. The train blocked my way forward. But it was here for a reason. It had a role to play. Stop. Crystal barrel shotgun, 50 max health. Lighting a direct hit with the flare pen. This is damage dealt at the last point of the chamber. Okay, we gotta go with the goose around. Because it's, it's the common sense to do. That's nice. I should work this out on a plot board. Whoa. the gasoline over the train car and I engage that would soon become a coffin
It's gonna be somewhere there. Oh. Yeah, let's light it up. This is where the history of the cult gets genuinely disturbing. The cultists track down the torchbearers living in the tunnels. They lap the poor folks up in a derailed subway car, doused it in gasoline. Yeah. Charming. It turns into a bit of a ghost story after that. They say the dark smoke from the fire still roams the tunnels searching for new victims to devour. There are no happy endings in this city. The story thread felt important. I could use it in one of the scenes I found. I had a new beat for the story. to be one more. So let's check the murder cult. I'm pretty sure it's this one right here. What has changed? It was locked from the other side. out here. There you go, that's it. The bowels of the bird carcass. The bowels of the bird carcass. The subway car had become a burnt husk. Damn. I could get through it now. That's horrible. Jesus. Jesus. Fucked up. Fuck me. Yep, that's pretty fucked up. Okay, let's move on. Okay, that's the door. So, I'm just gonna go down for now. sense it's over there I need to get rid of it okay there you go Oops. first damage dealt over there harder to detect increased damage would you of course make it harder for the enemies
here you go. seem to be any lights around here so it's probably not the way search for it. story to tell. I had a new idea for a scene. Blast those guys. Blast those guys off. Seems to be anything much from the FBI agent. And the clues is everywhere, Alan. Like, what else do you need? It says don't write. <laughs> and yet he keeps writing for some reasons. Okay, ammo. Nice. That's reload. Okay. Here. Next up on ammo. Man, Alan got so much resources compared to Saga. I mean, Detective Saga doesn't really have much to go with. Punch bearers. The scene changed with the story. So they burned this whole place down. 
It's coming. This is so true, detective. Totally. The Fed had witnessed something here that made him run scared. Whether the summoning ritual had been a bona fide supernatural event or the mass psychosis of stark raving lunatics, it didn't change the facts. Cult was messing with things no one should mess with. The ritual was a vital part of the story, the key to reaching the murder site. There's one more. Yeah, this is so Resident Evil, guys, and I think they're they're following the same blueprint. Story perfectly from that game, obviously. Here we go again.
Okay, let's go again. One more time. I don't know if we can find some ammo here on the top, but we'll see. Let's go check. Let's go a different route. to be the case here. Okay, let's see first. And then let's check the map again. Where should we go? Where is that? So it seems like we're gonna have to do this regardless. There you go, let's go find some more ammo. my health. Okay. Let's go get the painkillers. Make sure we get the full health again. Make sure we get the full health bar. Seems like the only way to 
goes up. So let's go up. I think I know where the murder site is. Isn't it here? Isn't this like the murder site? Let's go check it out. Summoning ritual. Let's go check it out. There you go. I don't even want to look. I don't even know what's so on. Here we go. Oh, no. oh well. Damn it. Here's like. Opens up a new path for us. The tunnel was open now. I could get through. Nice. Let's just fucking go. Let's just fucking go. Fuck this game sometimes. It's just. It's something. Alright, all that. I remember now. It was always out there. Haunting me. I think we ran out of battery. Okay, sure. Whatever. Side. That's Nightingale. Okay. I like how they blend. I don't know how they do this. Like the blend between. Damn, I really love the way they 
arranged the story the way they you know it's an amazing game it's an amazing game so all right i'm just gonna cut it right here and we're going to continue the next time in the next video but thank you again for uh, staying with me throughout the whole thing it was pretty it's pretty crazy but it's amazing all right check it out later bye